since the appearance of the first art form and while it spawned into black and white to color formats. Looking at these have become very interesting. As we move into the 21st century and beyond with the changes in technology and tools, we must also learn that anime trolling I've seen is a big issue from viewing a person's comments to news article posts that a true anime fan must not accept their toxic views. I do believe that when CGI anime comes into play while people rant over it, the toxicity has gone too far and must be addressed while understanding that, in quotations, we really appreciate the amazing conversation we are all otaku and it's fun to geek out is introduced as offensive they go a mile us as anime fans and not otaku should be said more and more to bring all anime fans together while the term is not the only issue from anime fans working at news sites discussing anime or its viewers to the companies who make them and their creators going at each other. We must no longer troll each other about it. We who are involved in the anime community must treat anime that is good or bad for the reasons with respect and to keep our comments to ourselves to whom those fans apply and have yet to be anime fans while we wait for them to learn and grow with our boundaries established together. From hosts who stream anime watch parties to the fan bases who dispersed their toxic comments in form of trolling, we must ignore them while we give them a chance in forgiveness. While we usher in a new movement to crush and reject anime fans who troll and whatever form. To witness the sight of true anime fans to emerge in bravery in healthy conversations shall be entitled to become true anime fans who are open minded, who don't claim that one anime is best of all time, who don't troll about the anime because of its bad animation. People who wish to become anime fans must evolve maturely and be willing to watch anime without negativity to have fun, exciting interactions. Never be called an otaku. We are anime gamer fans. Good evening, fellow anime gamer fans. It's time for this week's podcast. Let's go! The journey continues while accumulating more anime shows to watch with an open mind, starting with the continuation of Bufori, I Don't Want to Get Hurt So I Will Max Out My Dispense, Seasons 1 and 2. 
Ningen Fushin, adventurers who don't believe in humanity will save the world. The Ice Blade Sorcerer shall rule the world. Onimai, I am now your sister, and continuing to watch the rest of Inspector Seasons 1 and 2, along with the My Hero Academia Season 6 episodes, and the full lineup of the 2023 Winter Anime Season shows. Aside from the anime watch quest progress, Thumbnail sketching of the new prints for Valentine's Day and prints for the winter season of 2023 has started, and wanted to try out a new aesthetic for some new prints. Keeping warm and getting through 2023 just like the rest of you guys. While continuing the Star Trek Online Terran Empire arc for the first time, focusing on the mirror of the Prime Universe characters and the Milky Way galaxy, the journey to fight of the mirror of the alien object called the Other is now upon all Star Trek players online upon your call to service. While helping out the Terran counterparts, which started today, January 24th to February 23rd, 2023. While this video will focus in two parts to show the perspective on the latest episode of Stowe, oh, there is a way to earn your dilithium, but it'll be a bit different when players last played to earn their dilithium currency. The episode will start off by meeting up at Earth Space Dock and heading to the Gas Giant, where you will be combating the Other, which seems to have crossed universes. Now how will the solar system be fixed now from seeing what the player's perspective will see? What you will see after playing the space battle will be a galactic shocker. Your player will then head to Mars to evacuate personnel, which will feel like an attack on Mars TFO against the Synthwave ships, leading you back to Earth or Terra Firma, whichever the players were from the universes, to meet up with even a bigger surprising ally. Your player's ship, along with some non-playable vessels and crew, will travel into the other's interior to stop the Emperor and disarm and deactivate the other's abilities. Well, that goes for part one. See you in part two's video of the Fujiwara effect in Star Trek Online. That's it for tonight. While there will be more content to premiere and to share with you while keeping you informed, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the YouTube channel for more future content and join the Samurai Media Mainframe Global Discord server. Spread the joy and kindness, and have a nice night.